Hey guys, it's Taylor. Welcome back to my channel. I am in my house in Chicago as of this moment and I did some shopping in Mexico as well. If weekly haul videos are something you want to see, give me a comment in the box below or just give this video a thumbs up. I'd love to hear any other video suggestions as well. Without further ado, let's get right into it. So the first store that I went into was Zara. I only purchased one item from there. These strappy blue peep toe heels and I figured for summer a pop of color was perfect but I really liked this blue color. This next item I got in Mexico it's kind of a jumper cover up but I actually got it with Coachella in mind. I figured with some cute spanks and a cute bralette under it, it could be super cool with a fun shoe. So when I saw that in the little store at my hotel, I had to grab it. The next item I got is a pair of solid black espadrilles with a cute little woven side and bottom. I absolutely love espadrilles. They are the perfect shoe for summer if you don't want to go with a sandal and they're super easy to just kind of slip on. This pair here I still kind of have to break in. I just got them but I'm really excited to add these to my collection. So more recently I completely went through my closet. I went through my pajama drawer which was just a bunch of mismatched t-shirts and sweatpants and shorts and socks and just a random crock pot of comfortable clothing. So I kind of figured I needed to up my pajama game. When I was at Victoria's Secret, they had these cute little nightgowns. And I got this black one with baby pink straps. I just fell in love with it. It's super easy to slip on. Got this light blue paisley jumper also from Victoria's Secret and they're perfect for sleeping in or lounging in or again when you just jump out of the shower and you want something light to throw on. This next item here I also got in Mexico and it is a perfect head scarf or neck scarf and it is by the brand Zangara and I don't really know, I'm not familiar with that brand, I don't know if any of you are, but I just thought it was totally cute to wear on your neck. I've been wearing this black one that I borrowed from my friend Drew, so I figured it's time to get my own. So I didn't really realize when I was shopping, I was really drawn towards shoes. I'm always kind of drawn towards the shoe department, but I actually got four pair in the past two days and I did not intend to go shoe shopping but I guess I kind of did. The next pair of shoes I got I am obsessed with. I got these at Topshop. They're on sale for $30 and they're this reptile print. I don't really know. They're perfect for jeans or shorts. I think I'm going to wear it with just a basic pair of denim jeans and a white t-shirt and throw them on with like a big bag and I think that's perfect to make a casual outfit super cute. The last pair of shoes I got are also from Topshop and they're a pair of ankle boots. I am so obsessed with these. They look like burnt toffee at the top of a tiramisu. You know how they have that burnt caramelized sugar? That's what these look like in a boot. It's a tiramisu boot. Or is it creme brulee? And I've never had a boot this color. I usually gravitate more towards the dark browns or the blacks or grays. So finding a boot that's a really fun color is pretty exciting like it's like a lookbook when you move your feet and you're like ding, 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 ding. I thought those were the last pair of shoes but I was sadly mistaken and I realized I also got these shoes from Steve Madden they are super fringy and they are by Steve Madden but I actually got them at Saks Off Fifth or Saks Fifth Off I'm not sure which way you phrase that a neutral color goes with a lot. I really thought I was done with the shoes, but then I went in my bag and I totally forgot that I also got these. Anyways, these I got at Banana Republic on super clearance for around $12. They have these little studs on the top strap as well as a strap that wraps around the ankle and they're really rubbery and bendy and I thought that I might wear these to Coachella just because if they do get super muddy I can just rinse them off and they're brand new looking again. That's kind of where my head's at with these. So the last store I went to was Topshop. That's where I did the most damage yesterday when I was shopping. I'm going to kind of quickly go through what I got there. Some of the stuff is 
with Coachella in mind and other things are just for the upcoming seasons and some basics that I really want to add to my closet. So these are perfect for spring and summer as well as Coachella, which is why I got them. They're just a knitted short and they're high waisted. They're a little bit cheeky, but I figured Coachella is a cheeky place to be, so why not? To kind of go with the shorts, I found this off the shoulder printed tribal-esque top, but when I tried it on, I had this chunky gold necklace on and these big hoops. It was just such a look, so I'm really excited. I hope that I can possibly wear this to Coachella. Again, like I was saying before, I was kind of revamping my PJ wardrobe, so I saw these little mini Mickey Mouse PJ shorts and I just had to have them. And I might even wear them out with just like a white tee and some Adidas. I haven't decided yet. A little throwback moment. So I do have a bunch of different types of black jeans, but I just wanted a basic high-waisted, almost jegging black jean. And I found those at, oh my gosh. I just realized I bought the wrong pair of jeans and that's so disappointing. Well, this is the high-waisted Jamie from Topshop and I meant to buy the Joni. I had both of them in my dressing room and I accidentally checked out the Jamie one. That is super disappointing. Now I have to take my lazy bottom back to the store and get the other one. So this is my absolute favorite thing I bought in the past month, I would say. And it is a patch bomber jacket. As I said in my last haul video, I'm really digging the patches lately. Yeah, it kind of speaks for itself. I think my arm looks weird. I am probably a size 4 or 6 in this jacket, but I got it as a size 2 just because it looks super cute when it's kind of tighter and almost like a cropped bomber jacket. So if that's the kind of look you are going for, I suggest going a size down or two sizes down in Topshop bomber jackets. So the first accessory I got from Topshop are these key sunglasses. They are thick framed and they're clear, so I kind of thought the neutrality of them would go with all my looks that I have planned out for Coachella. The next accessory I got is this beautiful shell necklace. It reminded me of being in Mexico. I'm not too sure how I'm going to style it yet, but I have to wear this at some point because it is just so amazing. A giddy dog go. Next, I got a flowered ponytail. It was on sale for $2 at Topshop near the checkout, and I figured, why the heck not? It's so perfect for Coachella. Everything I'm kind of getting has Coachella in the back of my head. And this is how I'm gonna do my hair at Coachella, guys. One of the last accessories I got, I got for me and my friend, and they're actually mirrors. You kind of hang them on your car keys, but they're baby pink, and they say hashtag no filter. And it kind of has my friend written all over it, so I had to get her one as well. I'm such a mess. The next keychain I purchased is this little orange, and it has these little studs, and I don't really know why I got it. Summery, cute, why not? Thank you guys so much for watching. That is it for my video this week. If you have any suggestions at all, I would love to hear them in the comments below. And please give this video a thumbs up. I look forward to seeing you guys next time.